It's day one. We're on the airplane. We're on Hawaiian Airlines. Hey. I think we do that every time. We say Hawaii. <laughs> Hawaii. But we should make sure that it means something. All right, we're about to fly to Hawaii, so we're about to sit for five hours straight. We have so many activities planned. Do we? What should we do first? Sleep. Oh, I see. The end. Before I even get to Hawaii, I want to give a huge thank you to Disney's Moana for sponsoring this video, Hawaiian Airlines for flying me out there, and Disney's Olani for putting me up in their amazing hotel. Let's get ready to party. We just got to Alani and we're all just throwing our bathing suits on because we're going to the pool and I don't want to talk to you anymore because I want to put my swimsuit on and I go to the pool. To the Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're at a luau. Uh, funny fact, well it's not funny, it's just a fact. My roommate from college, whose wedding I went to in Hawaii a few months ago, her husband is the MC of this show at Alani. So, what? yeah! What? <laughs> what? Yeah. my big toe and I just started putting my sandals on and it got caught. No! <laughs> I tore! I wanted to focus on the grossness. You have no idea how big that toe is. <laughs> it's so big! Oh my god, oh my god. No, oh my god. Drop it, don't drop it, don't I drop it. I just drop it. It doesn't look that bad on my toe. No, your toe looks good. My toe looks fine, but that all just ripped off and it hurts. Oh. Throwing this away you now. <laughs> Oh, it's so loud and heavy. Yeah. Good morning, it's day two here in Hawaii. Do you like these sunglasses I got from the gift shop? Hey, oh, new sunglasses. Let's party. John woke us all up at seven. I woke up from him peeing in the toilet very loudly. Uh, but now we're all gonna go get breakfast. Actually, I have a phone call with my publishers in five minutes. And then we're gonna go all and get breakfast. The, why isn't this camera like focusing on me anymore? I'm not beautiful enough for you, vloggy. Come on. Breakfast, breakfast, breakfast. Corey, muckle, muckle. <laughs> he's the most excited about his. Breakfast was delicious. I pooped immediately afterwards and that was amazing. But now we're laying out at the beach. Hey, Colleen. I licked you. <laughs> that was peculiar, I apologize. We're laying out at the beach. I don't know, we got things to do today. And we're gonna do them and it's gonna be fun. We're going to Moana screening premiere thing tonight. Is it a screening or a premiere? I don't know 
know what it is, but we're going to see Moana tonight, and I'm very excited about that. I love Disney movies, and I love Hawaiian culture, so two in one. What's up, mother? Love her. Okay, that's all. I'm gonna lay out some more. Get some my, get some my tan on. All right, so we're walking up and down the coastal areas uh, near the hotel, and it's just so gorgeous. It's just so pretty. I'm just so happy. John and Colleen are serenading each other currently on her ukulele. I'm planning on buying her a ukulele for her birthday. I'm just gonna take her to a ukulele store and be like, pick one out. Anyway, it's just so gorgeous. Look at this. So we're at a character meet and greet right now where the kids are about to meet Moana. We're at the spa thing, place uh, in Alani. Uh, and I'm looking for under eye things to get rid of my bags because I don't like wearing makeup when I'm in Hawaii. <laughs> this, is, this is what I found. Ice water eyes, perfect for anyone with a face. But if you don't have a face, you can't use it. All right, so we're at a canoe thing and we're going to build and design this canoe, which we are very excited about. And I just had some, what, there's seaweed on my lip. I just had some Sam, what's it called? What is that called? Spam Musabi. It was delicious. Our canoe is called the Queen. Uh, part of it says, oh hi. Hi. It is pink, purple, and lime green. And it's, it's going Super well. Much. So much. It's going well. I think they have to glue it for us. Will you describe our canoe for me? Yes. This is the SS The Queen. <laughs> <laughs> On the canoe, we'll proudly display the word The Queen. Then we have the sail that is silken, that French vanilla in color. It says Yaw. <laughs> Savage. Our canoe's motto. Yon, queen, savage, war, slang. War. <laughs> and then we have the other side that says, hey girl. And it says, yes, gone, come girl. And then it says, oh, oh, oh. hi. <laughs> we are the most obnoxious people ever. I love also the butchers. The butchers. Between all of us. So Jacob has informed me that he has a girlfriend and asked me to pull a picture of her up and after a long time he finally told me her name. Here's the picture of her. They're madly in love. Apparently they had breakfast this morning. Is that true? Yeah. Alright. It's weird enough as a kid. But what about the other mouse? Like that hasn't Nikki? It was awful. We got back. We watched the movie. It was so cute. It was adorable. I'm obsessed with the little chicken. She has a little chicken as a best friend. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. Oh, hi, hi. That's we, what uh, at the resort, the kids met Moana earlier today, and she's hanging out with us. And when we built the canoe, we had to show her our canoe. <laughs> and it said, hi, girl. Or like, what did it say? Yeah, hey, girl on it. Hey, girl. Hi, girl. And she was like, I have a friend named Hey, hey. What would you do if you saw Hey, hey? <laughs> We'd say, oh, hey, hey, hey. Oh, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> we are so annoying. Yeah. But I was excited when I saw the chicken in the movie because then I could be like, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. He was cute. It was a cute movie. The songs are really fun. The songs are really fun, yeah. Uh, Dwayne The that. Rock Johnson can sing. He can serenade yeah. me any day of the week. I find myself slightly attractive to a very large Samoan cartoon for the first time in my life. Well, there hasn't been a Samoan cartoon ever. Oh, wait, no. Lilo and Stitch probably had one. I liked it. I love learning about the Hawaiian culture because I love it here and all the peoples. All right, I'm gonna go to sleep. Actually, that's a lie. We ordered room service and we're gonna eat pizza and then fall asleep. I ordered a sensible salad. No, you, and more How things. The salad was my idea. No. Yes. You said, should we get a side of something else? And I said, yes, yeah, salad. Oh, and I was thinking French fries. Yeah, I know you are. <laughs> hey, it's the next day. So I ended up not being able to eat any of the room service because my stomach hurt so bad. I realized I hadn't gone to the restroom in like three days and it all, I went to the restroom for those three days last night. <laughs> anyway, when I was in NorCal 
like several months ago, I lost my set of keys to my apartment. It was devastating because I was like, oh, I'm gonna have to remake those keys. I'm gonna have to get a new fob, which is gonna cost me like a hundred bucks. I just put it off. I didn't want to do it. Put it off. I put it off. I was like, I'm. I don't want to spend the money. <laughs> and I was going through my suitcase, repacking it, and my keys just popped up on the bottom of my suitcase. And I don't know how that's possible because I clean my suitcase out. There's nothing left in my suitcase when I come back from a trip. And also I've used it multiple times since that trip where I lost it. So I have no idea how it just randomly appeared at the bottom of my bag. Like I literally, when I thought I lost them, well, I had lost them. I ripped out my bag. I was shaking it. There were no keys. So I am actually blown away as to how they were in my bag just now. I don't know if it was a little fairy that just like stole them and then just replaced them just now. I have no idea what happened. My mind is blown. I do not know how they got back in my suitcase. Where did you come from? So we're leaving at 11 today. We woke up at seven, had breakfast with Colleen, and we were just like gonna chill. And John and I were like, dang it, we're in Hawaii. We're going on the water slide. So we're leaving in two hours, but we're we're gonna go on the water slide. Water slide! Let's go. Okay, we're about to go down the water slide. Oh, okay. I, oh, now I can. So John and I had fun on our little slide adventure and hot tub, but now we are at the airport because we're about to fly to another island. But first we're about to look at a Hawaiian Airlines airplane that they just decked out in Moana gear, which was pretty cool. So let's, let's go, where's on my chin? Is that just a shadow? Do I have a weird like vein in my chin? Hello. What's happening? Hello, everyone. I gotta go. Oh, I just got laid. I didn't even mean to. Look at, there it is. It's Moana sailing with her little pig. What's the pig's name? I forgot the pig's name. I was more interested in the chicken, hey, hey. All right, now we're on an actual flight. About to fly to no, Kona. No, we're about to fly. Why aren't we never flying? Or are we just not flying right now? We're never gonna fly? Then why are we on the airplane? Because why? We're not flying. When I got to the hotel last night, I got to grab a bite to eat and I fell asleep. And so I didn't film much, um, but it's a new day. I'm gonna go get breakfast with Corey, I think. And then we're all going to go meet down by the pool. And then at 12.30, we head out as a group like with the tour I'm with and we go sightseeing and then end up on the other side of the island and go to another hotel. I don't quite know what's happening, but you know I'm gonna fill you in on it. Okay, I just came up with something. I have a request for a smart person or a scientist or something. And I get 10% of this if you actually end up making it. So you don't have to spray on sunscreens. You can't quite tell what part of you you've hit or when it's dry for you to go in the water. So I'm thinking you should come up with the sunscreen and the spray bottle, whatever. So you spray it on, it's easy, you don't have to rub it. But then when you spray it on, it's pink. And so you know which part of it has hit you. And then once it dries, it turns clear so you know when you're allowed to go in the water, like it's dry enough to go in the water and it won't wash off. Genius, right? So you know where you've sprayed it on your body and you know when you're allowed to go in the water. Yeah, it's pink for a little bit, but I think it's mainly for like little kids, so you know what part of your kid hasn't been hit yet with the sunscreen. It's a genius. So make that happen and then give me 10% because I got the idea. Cool? Thanks. today um, we are traveling from one side of the island to the next but we're stopping at different lookout points wow it is gorgeous
take you home. You're all dirty. I found Colleen huddled by a fence and I had no idea why. There's kittens. <laughs> So we just got to our new hotel on the other side of the island. And look at my view from my bedroom. That's gorgeous. Honey, gee me. A queen! <laughs> Colleen's right next door. So sassy. Oh, I could sneak into a room in the middle of the night. Oh, by the way, I'm dressed as Colleen. We're inside of a lava tube thing. This is insane. Lava made this whole thing. These go for miles and miles. This was lava tubes that go for miles. How many of them are there? I was just vlogging on Colleen's camera and I realized it looked really bad. And that's because she was had her camera in a weird setting. So I look so much better now. Don't I look glorious? I look so much more attractive. So yeah, I just went to the volcanoes. A volcano. There was only one, I believe. I wish I could have been there at like s almost sunset so I could explore everything in the daytime and then s watch the sun slowly set and then see it at night because it is cool at night because you can see the lava glow and sprout and that was really cool seeing the lava like bubble. You cannot see it in this footage at all. It was a huge crater. It was a volcano. It was literally a hole to the center of the earth. That's what a volcano is. It is a hole to this, and the middle of the earth is spewing up. It is so hot that it's li it's melted rock and it's just spewing up. And it was beautiful, but you can't see it in a camera at all. Um, so I wish I could have been there in the daytime to show you guys at least like the crater, because that was huge. But yeah, so tomorrow is, we're flying back to Oahu, I believe, and then that's the end of this massive vlog, daily vlogging stuff. This stuff has all been thanks to Disney. Disney is amazing. I'm so stressed about my hat. I don't know how I want to wear it. How does Colleen just live with this? Um, that's good. <laughs> I'm gonna go sleep. See you later. Should I get one of these hats? I think I like them. I think I might get one. I just like that I can do the braid.